Weather has certainly been dominating the news the last couple of days, and here in town, we're just anticipating it's going to get hot again. Yeah, absolutely. And uh, we've only had four days so far this summer that we've hit 90 degrees, and that, that may sound like a lot, but Pittsburgh averages about nine days a year overall that we're above 90 degrees. So uh, late August is typical for us to have one or two of those days, and we may get there by Wednesday or Thursday. Right now we're at 74 degrees. It's a warm, muggy night. Light winds out of the west at three miles per hour. We're looking at partly cloudy skies and a little cloud cover will roll in overnight, but tomorrow we will have some nice bright sunshine for most of the day. Temperatures varying from 60s in Somerset and Waynesburg right now, all the way up to 74 in Pittsburgh, 76 in Connellsville, 72 in Beaver Falls and Cranberry, and then 70 for Newcastle, Butler, and Catanning. So the Almanac today showing that we made it up to a high of 86 degrees. Our normal high now this time of year has dropped a little. Our normal high is 81. Normal low 62. Our low this morning was 63. Sunrise tomorrow morning, 639 in the morning, and we're looking at temperatures that will be right there in the upper 60s, lower 70s by then. And then that bright sunshine starts to make that temperature really take off. By lunchtime, we're in the mid 80s. By later in the afternoon, high temperature all the way up to 88 degrees. So the radar, this is just a little bit of ground clutter there, but earlier this afternoon, we did have a couple of showers that tried to get rumbling through the laurels and the ridges. Really eastern corner of Jefferson County and Indiana County got a little sprinkle in spots. That's about it. So the big focus now is the tropical depression that was tropical storm and before that hurricane on re it's still spinning bands of rain through really eastern Pennsylvania, southern portions of New York, northern New Jersey, and then this will spin on out through New England and they're looking at possibly seven to 10 inches of rain in some of those areas. And right now the Scranton area, Allentown, Bethlehem, Reading, all getting very heavy rain and they have been all evening. That takes off to the north and east and uh, we're really looking at just a little spin off cloud cover from that here into western Pennsylvania and over into central Pennsylvania by tomorrow. There's the low headed out to sea and then after that we have some dry air and clearing skies across the entire Keystone State. Tomorrow we will start off with partly cloudy skies. It'll be mostly sunny by later afternoon. Maybe a slight chance of a stray shower popping up here and there, especially in the laurels and ridges. But most of us will see nothing but clear skies tomorrow. And then tomorrow night through Tuesday, boy, clear skies, the temperature takes off, and we don't have much of a chance at all for any rain on Tuesday. Wednesday, a little short wave of energy pushes through. We may see a stray shower start to pop up later in the afternoon, but by then, will be close to 90. So 69 your low tonight, tomorrow sunny, 88, a stray shower possible, very unlikely. And then Tuesday dry, 89, Wednesday, Thursday, 90. It will feel like the lower to mid 90s and we only cool off to the upper 80s, John, by next weekend.